So you've got high blood pressure and you want to get it lower fast, I'm going to give you a list. Number one, beetroot juice. So you're going to take a shot glass, put an ounce of beetroot juice in it, drink it every day. The research has shown that your first number of your blood pressure, the systolic number, will go down six points and the second number will go down four points. That is such a simple solution to lower your blood pressure. The great thing about beetroot juice is that it will start to affect your blood pressure within three hours. And there's gonna be a reference down below if you wanna read the studies. And by the way, my name is Dr. Story. I've been in practice for over 25 years. I'm gonna give you realistic advice based on my experience and based on the scientific literature. So everything that I'm saying is referenced. In addition to that, I'm going to try to make things easy for you so that you can actually do these things. I'm not going to give you an extravagant plan. So let's go into number two. Number two is a deep breathing exercise. And there are many different ways to do deep breathing. The important thing to, to remember that they all have in common is you want to breathe deep, you want to breathe slow, and just relax and let it go. Deep breathing works instantly, almost. It takes about five minutes. During that five minute period, you wanna take about 30 deep, slow breaths. It's not hyperventilating. The great thing about deep breathing exercises is that it can significantly lower the first number of your blood pressure, the systolic number. In some cases, it will reduce your first number by 30 points, which is amazing. The reason why deep breathing seems to work so well is it does two things. Number one, it stimulates your parasympathetic nervous system. So it calms the mind, it calms your body, it stimulates the part of your nervous system that helps you relax and digest food. So it helps in that regard because it'll actually dilate and open up your blood vessels. The bigger the blood vessels, the less pressure in them, which means lower blood pressure. The second mechanism by which deep breathing works is when you do a slow, controlled, deep, breathing exercise and it takes about five minutes, your body will actually start to produce more of a gas called nitric oxide and it's inside the arteries. And this gas will help dilate and relax the blood vessels. Blood vessels get more pliable and flexible, bigger, blood pressure goes down. Now this third one is really awesome because it is so easy. It's something you could do every day is you can get enough magnesium in your diet. And for many people, they just don't get enough. So you just take a supplement. Again, there's references down below if you want to read the studies. I'll also put a reference of what type of magnesium I personally take. You can look at the one I take. If you want to get it, it's fine. If you want to get a different one, it's totally up to you. I've done all the research and magnesium citrate seems to work the best. If you're a male, you would take about 400 milligrams. If you're a female, you would take less, about 310 milligrams. And you take the magnesium every day and you just simply watch your blood pressure go down. I went to the chiropractor and he said that I had an acute attack of lumbago. And I said, I'd hate to see the ugly attack. <laughs>